the lower slot. So yeah, you'll put it right, right inside of there. Yep, and I'm only going to go in a little bit, don't you think? Yep. And just see, because I do not want to need. Yeah, I would probably go in about six inches or so, and then and then turn, break it loose, okay. and then we'll just wait about a minute and see what happens. Oh, so then, okay. Okay. Hang on, hang on. How far? You think that far? Yeah, that's that's good. Okay, you ready, honey? Uh -huh. Okay, well. Is it hard to turn? There we go. There you go. And you can see it broke loose. And there's the honey coming out. Oh my god. Where'd you see it break? Where'd you see the break though? Oh, what? On the, yeah, right on, here. got it. Got it. The other guys, what they did is they put this completely in, and so all the honey just came rushing. We well, ought to share that with uh, Flo. Well, they Flo does say that they just said to do it if it's hard to turn. They didn't say if it's flowing too fast. Well, you can see all of those uh, cells emptied out there. Just the last inch or so is left. Huh? Yeah, it's amazing. Okay, so do more. We're ready yet? Uh, I don't know. Look at the. Oh yeah, no, it's still see, coming. It's still pretty yeah, full. Yeah, pretty the, thick. The tube right there. Yeah. I would probably wait till that goes down about yep. half full and then go. Looks like it's starting to. Oh, maybe not. So that's what I'm saying. I I would imagine if you had opened that whole thing at once, it would oh my be God. flowing yeah. over the sides, you know. Which is what probably happened with uh, people that had a bad experience. Get, with what's it. It, Gary and. Like it's working pretty good. Wow, it's yeah, it's almost full, isn't it? This, uh, it's actually getting oh, oh, shoot. oh sorry. Oh. It's actually getting fuller. The tube is, huh? That's Looks amazing. Like it. Yeah, you gotta keep an eye on me. I'm kinda I'll go and, and knock something over. It's all right, <laughs> the same way. Well, I was going to bring a cardboard table with legs on it when I did it, just in case I didn't want well, I it. think, you know, next time we'll figure out a better way. I want to get a picture of the side door here, too, and show how much this is. Well, I think the card table I have. That almost looks fake. That, that almost <laughs> did you take a picture of that, video. honey? Did you take a picture of that? No. There they are. And it's completely capped off. Hang on a sec, oh, sorry. Let me get some sunlight in there. Yeah, we tried this before and you get quite a bit you of reflection. And here's what's going on in front. They're just out here in the breeze, having a nice yeah, day. Yeah, themselves, trying to stay. It's cooler today than it was, um, you know, we get this breeze, which... Yeah, these guys aren't so happy over here since we totally destroyed their... Not totally, but nest with there. Man, that's a lot easier than those centrifuge yeah. things. <laughs> well, Brian said, he asked me if we extracted it. I said, yeah, we did it one year and it was a nightmare. He does the same as we do. One. I think I did three or four. And I just scraped it off and then I just put them in those filters like you and I were talking about from... Yeah. Well, I can tell you right now, this is going to be the future in commercial beekeeping. It has to be because it's all about man hours and this would reduce the man hours. We well, gotta figure out a more cost effective. Now that they're manufacturing this in the United States. Well, it's like calculators. Once you start making more, they come down in price. And of course we were on the bandwagon. <laughs>